of the court. And we are recording. We live no, on the podcast. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> hey, I got to I'm gonna do the screen. I ain't got the screen up yet. But uh, if y'all on YouTube, y'all just watching. Oh, there we go. All right. So, yeah. Hold on. A lot of stuff. Yeah, I've been looking at the wrong damn thing. All right. Oh, uh, let's do it like this again. We're going to put it in the middle again with the little backdrop. I like that better. Uh, yeah, it, it's it's been a long week of stuff. I'm trying to figure shit out. Look at this. Okay. We good now. We good. All right, y'all. So if you on YouTube, I mean, y'all, Spotify, all that stuff, listen to it. I'm on, it's a bunch of other websites that it's on Spotify, uh, Amazon Prime, iHeartRadio, any other thing, uh, Spotify, podcast, like everything, it's everywhere. But, uh, I guess the first thing it was the damn Mavericks game. The Mavericks lose game one, and I lost some money. Out of, well, I only lost five dollars, but I, I I got a bet site where I, I could have won like a hundred. But it was two things. It was two things that happened. That uh happened that I lost, and I'm so mad about it. Oh, uh, first I had see who I had Luka Doncic. Let me see if I can if I can see it. Let me see if I can look at this. I can look at my little stats here. All right, so lost. All right, here we go. I had two bets, right? For five dollars, just a five dollar bet. Could have won fifty. Oh, uh, so I had lively. I had them less than one and a half steals and blocks. He had one steal, one block. I had Kleber, I didn't know who this guy is, M. Kleber, to make no three-pointers. Yeah, he had, Matt's Kleber. Yeah, he said. Well, they've been seeing him play yeah. for some reason. And they, I said, yeah, he's probably not going to get in the game. So, yeah, then I am mm-hmm. Horford to get no steals. But the only thing that happened, and I got close to it, was Luka Dungeons. I said, all together, 42 and a half points, rebounds, and assists. He got, like, 30 points. He got the, the stat. Look at the stick of the stat. He got the 41. The 4205. He got the 41 out of, the, out of that. And I fucking lost because of that. Damn. And then the second one was right. Everything else was right. The second one, I had Kyrie Irving. I had a, well, he had a, a special point. He got a little special. So all, all he had to do was get one point. Yeah. So he got the, so yeah. yeah. So all he, got, he got his one point. That's all I need was one point. I had Tatum at two and a half threes. So three three pointers. He made three. I had Jay Holiday at more than four assists. He had five. And the kicker, which killed me, is this nigga Jalen Brown. I had him at 35.5 fantasy points. See, I don't play fantasy basketball like that, so I, just, I, I thought that was a lot of points. I had him, I had under, I went under 35 and a half. I said he won't go over. He hit 42.2. And I was like, God dang it. This God dang Jalen Brown. Jalen Brown and Luka Dungeons, the two people that just killed me. Yeah, Jalen Brown just ultra-rising <laughs> folks. And, he was out there playing crazy defense. Yeah, great. He won the best off for him as defense. Uh, that's why uh, they was like, <laughs> they got him and they uh, got somebody to deal with. Uh, yeah. uh, with Luka? Yeah, Luka and... Um, and Tatum was not, yeah, and then Kyrie didn't really do much. But Porzingis was the guy who they couldn't stop. I thought, damn, I said we got, I thought we got rid of Jokic. I thought we had to worry about Jokic. And I said if he played, he would be the, he the, he would be the uh, X factor. And look what happened, Lord. If it wasn't for his points, I feel like Miles probably would have won the game. And that's what Skip says. Skip says, uh, you know, y'all should be lucky. And I didn't listen to no analysts. I said <laughs> this. I was like, and look yeah. what happened. And Kendrick Perkins actually said it too. So, but I think he said the day after I said it to myself. But anyway, that's a different yeah. story. But um, yeah. uh, hopefully the Mavs just. I'm not trying to be biased here. I'm just speaking yeah. as a fan, a fan of basketball. Hopefully oh, they man. can take game two, send it back to Dallas, tied one one. Then it'd be very interesting going to I that so. going to that uh American Airlines Arena. Yeah, I want. Uh, 
America nigga, was my center. My bad. I was gonna get to a game. I know the tickets gonna be pretty high, but I was like, I mean, actually, yeah. the, going downtown though. I was downtown yesterday with my cousin. I took him up to Dallas, so we yeah. were there downtown. Mm-hmm. That little area where you can just be, you can just really sit outside, watch the game, yeah. and be out there with the stadium. Man, my cousin, only because he used to stay at the, we're close to the stadium, like right across the street was the stadium. Some of the Mavericks players used to live in this building. My cousin stayed in. It was a nice place, real nice little high rise. Hello, he's had little parties. Yeah, yeah, man. Why my cousin? Though, my, my cousin, he used to have, we used to, me and my other cousin, we used to always speculate, how did he get all these houses? He would always get a house, then he would leave. We like mm. we, we were like, hmm, he must be house sitting for these people or something. Uh, house jacking around. Yeah. <laughs> he would always he have a place. He, he was like, oh, I sold the house, or I did this. He would always just have a place, it'd be nice, and then all of a sudden, yeah, I sold it, I did this. And like, I went to this place, and he had a place in New Orleans, he said. No. When I was staying down the way, it was close to New Orleans. He said, yeah, you can come stay over there. I was at D. That's when I was working with Wiss. And they was in these shitty hotels, right? So I was like, I don't want to stay in one of them. He's like, well, like, we go to my house. You know, he's like, hey, you can stay in my place. All right, cool. And then uh, I got there. I look at the house like, damn. It's nice for house. But I, look, I, look at it, I walked through his room. He, he had like a suit, maybe a shirt, a pair of shoes. Like, he didn't even got much clothes in his house. Why he? Because he's always I'm like, Pfft. And my cousin was like, yeah, he probably, that's probably somebody's house, some Airbnb house that he, that somebody rent us. So I don't know. We, we, we used to be speculating. But my cousin used to scam us all the time. My cousin, did I tell y'all, he, he scammed us. Well, he, we, we were supposed to go to, uh, what's that place called? We were going to go to the beach. We were going to go to the beach. We had a plan. We, just, we used to, we see, back in the day, we were still trying to get that money. So my cousin, we were like, look, let's just, let's mow yards and stuff. Just get the money. Because my, his, uh, my mom, no, my auntie, she was gonna take us. No, my cousin, my cousin, the cousin, his sister was gonna take us. Okay. He said, "Well, if y'all give us the money, the gas money, raise the money, we'll take you." So we said, "Okay, let's go cut yours." We so we started cutting yours and getting money. We made like made like two hundred dollars almost or something. I don't remember how we got the money or something like that. And my cousin got there. He was like, "Yeah, it's time to go. We're getting ready to go. We had our stuff ready. I had my boogie board." Him, my cousin pull up with the sister. He got my sis, his sister, which is my cousin, my my cousin, the the driver, which is my cousin, a girl in the back, whoever this girl with, and their baby. So there's four people in this car already. There's no room for one person. Hmm. And my cousin, you know, he me and my cousin, we got clear like, yeah, hey, you wanna come? You can come with us. And I was like, no, nah, I'm gonna come with my cousin. We went to we actually went to celebration station. My cousin, her mom, they took us. We went to celebration station that day. Anyway, he like, what kind of bought the boogie board? We was like, man, yeah. I was like, man, this nigga really scammed us. We was like, my, and my auntie was like, yeah, y'all should have never listened to him. We look, look, look. That's just that's crazy because today, that's the day I seen a dude that looked just like Tupac, like exactly like Tupac I think in I Dallas. Know what you said yeah, something about that. This dude looked exactly like Tupac. It was like we we <laughs> saw it, yeah, yeah. and that's funny. Guess what I listened to on the way here? Some Tupac, All Eyes on Me album, couple songs out. Oh, Check yeah. out time and uh can't see me, but anyway, it was in my head. But anyway, oh, yeah, I like that. Can't see me, you can't see me. <laughs> yeah, that beat go up. I make the motherfucker shake, roll, and roll game. <laughs> and I ain't talking about road dog Jesse James. Yeah, we got a lot of people wrestling. Uh, uh, <laughs> you see that? Yeah, we listening yesterday. I've been listening. To, I, I found it on. I guess on Spotify now. Uh, it's like the uh, the DX song, the Run DMC oh DX. Lord, I <laughs> greatest thing song, I think the greatest thing song ever. He was dead very everybody. I've been seeing people post about it every now and then. I gotta say DX thing, the greatest thing song ever. DX thing song. That Run DMC one is good. Even yeah, the original, the progression version of that. Yeah. Hey. Greatest thing song ever. Greatest interest ever. Like you just got. I mean, I guess the Bloodline would be my favorite one. Nothing now, but I think DX kind of. It's my favorite of all time. I mean, it's got the rap version to it. It's got, I mean, it is like, <laughs> man, you can't, you have to give me a while. You like, man, your favorite. Man, I got so many because I'm, in, I'm into that intro yeah. shit. I'm all, I can't name my favorite. It's hard, It's too hard to me. I was like, I think DX, I was just so into DX and everything. And we were just, I think that was like the yeah. New Age Outlaws were two of my favorite tag teams. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The, the Outlaws. Yeah. Outlaws. Oh, yeah, my top tag. I already said my top tag teams the Outlaws, the Usos, the Rockers. Mm-hmm. We've got two tag, three, three tag teams. And if I'm not some pretty, I feel like, dang, y'all miss, you forgot the, well, I got, you know, the Legion doing, they were cool. Yeah. 
Yeah. Demolition was cool. I like I like that. I put Demolition in my four. What's up, brother? I put Demolition at four. But uh yeah, oh Demolition, baby, yeah. Ooh, that's a that'd be a good list right there. That'd be and then they, had a, they had a nice little thing song. Demolition. Something hey, like hey, that. Hey, that. Hey, that. That's just go that's just go hard too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you know on your phone? Did you know one of the dudes turned to the repo man? Was the repo man? I did not know that till the Jim yeah, Cornette was talking. Shit Jim Cornette was yeah, talking about it. Yeah. yeah, one of the guys, whoever he turned, he, that's what his, that was his next game at the repo man. One of those oh, guys. Yeah. yeah, he's the repo man. I never knew that until I started listening to Jim Cornette. You know about them tag. That's my childhood. That's my yeah. friend, my brother, right there, man. Yeah. Hey, it's bigger than two. They're, they're, they're not a bigger Tupac fan. Hey, uh, JFK fan. Anything JFK? JFK that's the guy, right? There. Oh, did you, what, did, did I tell about the JFK? My little theory. I went to, because I, I went back there yesterday. Listen to this theory, Jake. Jake, what's it? Okay, I'm going to tell you, I'm doing my, my JFK theory since I, I've been listening to stuff that I've compiled the theory of how this could have went. So, the dude, I, I was listening to a, I was listening, I was listening to a podcast the other yesterday about the JFK, about this dude, how they said, how they the dude met. So, fact, it was a fact. This was a fact. After the shots, after the shots went down, one of the motorcycle cops thought he he thought the shots came from the from the top of the building. He saw pigeons fly up, and said so. He went ran into that building. It took him like a minute and twenty seconds to get to the second floor. Where he said he saw as well walking kind of fast walking, but he wasn't like Ty. Well, he said he, he saw he, he saw him, so he's like, "Hey, come here!" And he said Oswald turned around calmly and walked back to him. He wasn't like because he was on the, if he was on the sixth floor, he had to run down there. And it said it would took them at least a, the exact same time to get from the sixth floor to the second floor. It was took Oswald the exact same uh, almost. Here and there, maybe during it, but it would take them around that time, maybe a second more to get the exact time. Stop. But he said, Oswald looked at him. I mean, he was uh, he wasn't he wasn't like huffing and puffing from running down there. He was calm, and he was like he's walking. You know, he said the boss who was behind the cop walked behind him and came like, "Who's this, y'all?" He worked here, and they let him go. But yeah, he was walking. That now he that he say claim he was walking like he said he saw him on the second floor walking. Kind of fast walking towards the end of the lunchroom. Now, that theory, still, they said there was somebody was there was somebody in the damn the party shooting shots. Somebody. So my theory is this. The shots that came from the top were the ones that missed. And it could have been more shots. But there was somebody in the grassy knoll, and there was somebody underneath the sewer. I looked at the sewer, I took a picture of it. And the guy who talked about this told us said this. He said his name was some Lawrence something Lawrence something a kid. I don't know. I don't buy the kid thing. They had some kids that were back to this time. He said it was some kids and one of them went through the uh, sewer mm-hmm. and uh, got all muddy and he went to work at this auto shop. He had got a job at and he said he looked at him. He was all muddy and stuff. This it was another. This a guy. I, I think this place is like in Allen, Texas or something. These dudes were talking about it. But for I like that. Well, this is what I think. I, this is because the shot came from that sewer. I don't know if it's the kid, the Lawrence guy that this dude said, but I think it came from that sewer. And the shots that went through the throat could have came from top. Either the shot from the top came to the throat in the back, and then the one from the side was the shot that missed. Or one of the shots they got, because one of the bullets were found inside the seat. So I think the fatal shot came from the from the sewer. That's what I think. The fair shot came from the sewer. You can't. That's the. It's a perfect. You can do it. Can't nobody see you. Can't nobody find you. Cause you after the, after the shots came out. Yeah. How did you have to get away from? If you're on the grass, you know, you still have to get away. And uh, the, the sky or act like you would see. Well, you could have disguised himself and see. Well, who, I don't know. And then okay, there's people that say they there was a witness. I was looking up how they said they seen a car, a station wagon, what a grass and what or something like that. With a black man or something, and a, some white dudes, a black man, and he got in the car and they drove off, sped off, something like that. But yeah, I think he came from the. I think he, I think it came from the, uh, from the underneath. Well, we do. You, yeah, you know, you seen the video. Man, <laughs> I know. Cause you were yeah. talking about it before. I don't... Yeah, it makes sense to to do that because like the stool depository, you gonna do this. 
Especially okay, how to if 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 Oswald was the shooter, and he did this, he had to like I say, he had to get down those stairs within a minute and fifteen minute eighteen seconds to meet up with that cop that saw him. So that's perfect timing. Was it was his perfect timing that he, but they like say he was he was still walking. He was fast walking, but he was calm. He was calm. He looked. He wasn't like distraught, stressed. He was just calm, and he was just like. What's up? Like they just said what he said. He, did. They, he was just cool. And he said, and then the dude who took him to work that day said he had a bag or something. He's like, what's in that bag? He's like, uh, remember I had some, he needed some curtain rods. He had to go to his wife's house. Cause I remember, I don't know if you noticed that his wife stayed in another part of town. He stayed in Oak Cliff. They had broke up or something. So he went to, the, to his wife's house where his guns was at or something like that. The gun was missing when they found, they went to the house and searched his house. But they said the dude says so he said the gun that Oswald could have had did not look big enough to fit that bag that he had in the car when he picked him up from work that day. He said even broken even if the gun was broken down, it still wasn't big enough. That's what the man said. But then I seen a picture of something that looked like it could, I don't know. But I'm like, uh, maybe he got maybe he gave the gun to somebody. He like he knew something. I say, remember he said he was in the CIA or something like that. He was everybody. The, the CIA knew about Oswald. Mm. He knew about something, but he didn't think. Maybe he didn't think they was gonna he they was gonna pan him in it. But they's like, maybe he supplied the gun to somebody, and they somehow got the because he could he could be like, hey, I'm a, I'm a secret service guy. I need to come up here. The cop the the uh the president's coming because you know I'm pretty sure they scammed the place before he came. Like hey, we we need to make sure there's a safe entrance or something. That's a that's a good way, you know, fake pose as a fake as a fake CIA agent or mm -hmm. Secret Service agent. That's another way, but not just just some guy. Oh, so, oh I'm just gonna go up there shoot, run down there and do it. That's just too much. This is too. It is too perfect. This is too much. And then I'm I seen it, and that tree is still there to this day. If you look for no, it's hard to make that shot with that tree in the way, unless you just made that shot from coming down the street from Houston Street. It's like it's a straight shot. If you'd have made it there, it's a straight, perfect, clear shot. But he, when he turned on M Street, the trees in the way, kind of, and it's yeah. and like, so I'm like, mm, so I don't know. Cause y'all dig for this stuff. I be feeling yeah. like. <laughs> See, he said, yeah, and that's what he said. Found yeah. a gun on the sixth floor. Um, yeah, he spoke on the car. He know, man. He a, he yeah. a student. Mm -hmm. What's funny gives me is they found the gun on the sixth floor. They found the the shell casings, which was like three bullet casings. So I'm like, could it be like it, it was either Oswald made the shots or somebody who had the gun, he gave the gun. Somebody had a gun. Somebody else had a gun. And they just blamed him. Because they still remember the gun he had was like one of those shots. You got to shoot it, do this little boat. That's in, shoot, 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 shoot. And there was like five seconds within the murders when the way the shots happened. Like it took like five seconds or something from the, when you see the video. So it's like, it's hard to say. Also did that. Then had to sit the gun down, move stuff around, then get downstairs, and there's some type of elevator was kind of crazy and shit. It's, it's, it's a lot. It is a lot to be. But although like oh, uh, like I said, in school they they all everybody, everybody in school in school that was taught us also I did it. We always yeah, always did. That's, the, it's like, <laughs> that's what the thing was. But let's dig deep. Hey, I'm gonna be like, fuck it. If if it's some if it's some variables, let let let's let's revisit. So we just yeah. gotta. You just hey, that's the dig. And he said a very shitty rifle. Yeah, the rifle wasn't that good. They do. I listened to some yesterday. He said <laughs> that rifle was not that good. And you gotta be like, you have to be a good shot. Cause remember, the ladies didn't get the girls. The women didn't get shot at all. The wife. And the governor Conley White, none of them got hit. Only uh, uh, Kennedy and uh, Governor Conley. And then they said, "But that, that magic bullet crap. I don't believe that. There's no way bullets do all that stuff. Just go here, 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 and flipping all the way." So I like to say, I think it's more. It was more shooters. If Oswald was involved, he college, he maybe so. They somebody people did see him on the sixth floor. It was a black guy who worked there or something. So people saying they seen him on the sixth floor. But at the time of the shot, they say, because one people say when the shots came out, that nigga was on the on the second floor drinking a coke in his hand. One of the ladies said he saw him with a coke in his hand. Yeah, he said uh, went he <laughs> went he went to the coke machine and got a coke. 
Yeah, and then, that's when that's like twelve thirty. That's when there's heat because he's right when the shots are happening. So how the hell he do all this, and then go downstairs, get a coke, and do all this? Just I was all like, he's the best assassin ever. With a city rival. Yeah, with a city rival. <laughs> Damn. Motherfucker, that old, uh, <laughs> okay. Motherfucker, Russ, 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 Russ,
I said it. I actually put that on the comment, and I will say it verbally now. I don't give a damn. I'll tell anybody, hey, yeah. if you want to see an art museum, it's in East Texas. Art come, museum. Come see the art. Like, wh- it what is. You, wh- what, you, well, what you mean? Sure. What you mean, CJ? What you mean? Look, sure. it's just, and, and, it, and it probably proves it because I see a lot of comments, women saying, who is these girls? I've never seen them. <laughs> Now, I'll yeah. say this. I haven't seen everybody, but some of them, but I know everybody different. Like me, I might see them because, well, yeah. I'm at these events. So that's the only reason. Yeah. That's the only reason. That, yeah. That's a lot of reason because I'm cause i at the events. But some of them you know because yeah. you hear about, well, oh, she's a female artist or she a model. Or, oh, yeah, I know a bunch of good artists. You audience. know, <laughs> she might be, uh, what you call it, she might, she got some kind of business that's, that's booming. Yeah. So yeah. so you're going to be known. So, But at, at, but at the same time, this is the thing about yeah. it. The re, This is why I talk about appreciation because some of y'all say, damn the list. Mm-hmm. Some of, most of y'all say, damn the list because you wasn't on it. Yeah. In, in a way, who gives a damn? Because at the end of the mm-hmm. day, if damn. there's 20 people, I always used to say this. I used to say this. I, I'll give you an example. If, if we got two Lambos outside, 100 mm-hmm. people want it, what are we going to do? Mm-hmm. The numbers don't add up. Yeah. So if you pick 20 women, just like right now, if I put my 20 women out there, people going to be mad. Oh, why you? Yeah, <laughs> we did some. Why you didn't put me on it? Well, shit. If I'm making a list, I'm going to be, hey, it's like my brother Jake say, I put my analyst hat on. I know my. it's a difference between the analyst hat and yeah. the fan hat. You know what I'm saying? Alice hat. Green. So, at the end of the day, and then on my list, I might put something on her, but probably don't think much of me, but I'm a, yep. it's just like, it's just like a GOAT debate in any sport. Oh, well, he he didn't say he was a GOAT because that was his nemesis. So what? Just be yeah. real about the shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, that, that, and, but, but a lot of us ain't mature enough to yeah. just, Oh, that's a good list, and then move on. I ain't on the damn list. Yeah, my some of the motherfuckers that say they ain't on the list, they might be a seven or eight. Yeah, I'm just hey, I'm being honest. Yeah, yeah. this coming from an ugly guy. I can say what the fuck I want. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know yeah my, saying, my, my, based my on starting, what y'all think of me. My starting five was pretty good list of people. That was my. And that was yeah. pretty fine. You know what? I'm and gonna see, go. They were quiet about it. They didn't want to. You know what I'm telling you? This is my. I'm gonna okay, do a five. I'm, trying right I'm gonna do five. Five women that I think are the finest in these tapes to me. I think number one at this point right now gotta be gonna put it in order. Well this 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 is she number one and no every else no order. But this is just hey, number one. This is number one. Smitty Hawkins. I think Smitty Hawkins is number one. Number one baddest in these Texas. No I doubt know, about she's it. She's an automatic she should be on all yeah. lists. You know, I'll say that. I'm gonna say Smitty is number one. On a, I can speak on a lady. She on she's my number one. I think she's number one. I'm gonna put Juanita on there. The old Juanita, I like her too. She was thicker. See, New Juanita, either, what, what? <laughs> both of them, either either one. She pretty. I'm gonna put her list. There's another one that I, you don't. I'm gonna put a name out here. That I think she the fine. She fine too. You know her, but you, she don't get out like that. Nickel B or something. Her name Nickel Nikki. Oh, Nikki B. Yeah, Nick. Uh, shout out to Nikki B. Um, yeah. Yeah. Tagging it. She'll probably be out for Juneteenth though. See, <laughs> yeah, yeah, they all top, come out. She a top five. five. She a top five. She's a top Nigga be a top five. And then I'm going to go with, um, let me look through my messages because I got a bunch of reds to make sure I got the right ones. Uh, if I'm going to go, eh. Oh, I got a list. Uh, you're going to say best. I can't put the, <laughs> uh, the, the emoji queens. How about that? We'll do that. One. Emoji put, queens. Put y'all, on, put y'all on front street. I'm on front street like I used to. You like that, Jake? I'm on front street. They don't know about that. <laughs> hey, he talk, hey, uh, a bold first. Tell him, tell him what the YouTube. <laughs> hey, okay, Tambria. I'm gonna go Tambria. I think Tambria's up there too. I feel like Tambria is like up there. What Tambria you talking about? Tam- but now nah, we ain't got a uh, the, my, my former co-worker. Tambria. Yeah, yeah, Tambria, yeah, Tambria. Yeah, <laughs> you know, I'm gonna tag her. There's another one. Tambria that should be on really? everybody's what? list, but and people know what I'm yeah. talking. I ain't gotta say it. My <laughs> last name, you know who it is. 
Yeah. So oh, like, you know what? Then I'm going to go Peach. Peach Queen for this. I'm going to go Peach Queen. What's she, what's she been at? I ain't seen nothing. Like, like, anybody put her on the list? Yeah, why do y'all... Come on, Peach Queen. Why y'all ain't put Peach Queen on her? She's like... I, she I didn't think, think she was real. She was so fine, I didn't think she was real. And TZ had to go tell her that. She told her in person. <laughs> See, I say shit in, to your face. Yeah. That I didn't say, I want you yeah. to really... You know what I'm saying? I say... It's some stuff I want to so, say to people to their face. I don't want to message. I don't want to. I like damn. She's so fine. I didn't think she, I, I didn't know. I didn't think Juanita was real until I seen her at the club at the other damn show, the the young girl show. The young girl <laughs> in that show. The league. <laughs> Y'all remember when that shit was that? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> young girl. <laughs> young girl. <laughs> <Show. laughs> <Show. laughs> hey man, <laughs> like, but the list. Um, <laughs> I mean, hey, I, hey, you know what? I know it, it ain't even close to Halloween. Halloween's so like, you know what? Yeah. I would want to be Jared the Christian. Yeah. Oh, just that. You just going on the list? <laughs> the list. I'm going to make my own and carry that fucking list around. What about the top messiest female list? The, the messiest, the star drum list. I know who put on his list. Boy, man. I got a list for that one. I'm crazy. Oh, oh, yeah. they don't, I ain't going to say it on this. I wouldn't even say it on this one. Yeah, I, I got a name that this. Hey, he ain't lying though. It's 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 more than one, Jake. I have to tell you. Uh, we talk. He said that was funny. We thought they were. She's so fine. Hey, they feel real. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a good one. I mean, I thought I can tell. I I I know catfishing women to be catfishing and see. You know, fuck with me, catfishing in <laughs> mine, and yeah. I ate some good catfish again <laughs> yesterday. I hate, Shout I out fish. to the Fish Hook Cafe. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the fuck it is. Yeah. Nah, nah, yeah. It's, it's a hidden gem. Uh, <laughs> best pinto beans I've had. Pinto, pinto. No, if you like pinto beans, yeah. pinto beans. Pinto beans. Oh, yeah, pinto. If it, you it, know it, where the old Rio at, you know where it's at. Is that Jamaican place open today? From, you said Jamaican oh, food. yeah, man. I want to go get some oxtails again, man. Do they got, like, Jamaican food? or is it Yeah, like, they got some goat on there, curry. And... I might go there. We, well, speaking of going somewhere. Oh. Oh. Speaking of going somewhere. I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to think. I was in oh, yeah. six, my Yeah, I'm saying I got the mask winning tomorrow. But there's yeah, that place, man, though. God damn it. I'm supposed I'm to go sorry. to this Miss Houston place. This you know, Houston snow cone place. Yeah. Oh, yeah well, she wanted you. to go just now. I know they said they closed at 8. Uh, it's on True Fireway. So yeah, you get done by seven. We should be in time to do that. But I thought it's oh I because thought, I looked on the thing. I want she said like, I wanted to see what the snow cones talking about. But I seen they got stuff. Thing, what's the name it was real Jake? And I'm gonna show you. And something. they got dirty rice. I seen they got dirty rice. That's what it was, that's man, what brought me to it. They got dirty rice. rice. Man. Yeah. So I'm gonna see if I can make it out there. But before that, I I, was, I said that uh the list of the fee there. We got June 10th coming up. What's the plan? Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, we, hey, you know what? You know what? I'm going to say it right now. I can say it off the air. We yeah. might even come back with a list. Well, we have yeah. to do it not on the next yeah. episode, but the episode out there. We might yeah. do a list of the baddest dressed women from Juneteenth weekend. We might do that because we ain't never did. Oh, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. That's, that's a good one. That's we might do a one. top five, ten, depending on what we, you know. That's a good one. It's like a now. I got to remember, you probably know more than their names than me. I'll probably see them and like, dang, I didn't. And I'm probably going to see them and then they, I'm, I'm like, dang, I didn't know their friends. I'm like, oh, I didn't know I was friends with this girl because you know they're going to post pictures of their stuff. Yeah. You be like, oh, shit. I didn't know. And I just seen you. I done seen, I done seen uh, a a lady on my, I be like, oh, shit, that's her. I didn't know she was on my Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that either. I did it all the time. You know what I'm saying? Because I was like, well, damn, she was wearing that shit last night. And then I see it. You yeah, know, yeah. when they, look, you know they post it on Sunday, you know. So next yeah. Sunday is on, they're going to be posted like a motherfucker. Hey, I need, some, I need to go back to get some shoes. Do I want some more shoes? I don't want to go to Dallas. They're going to be posted on, no they're going to be posting on somebody's birthday. Somebody's yeah. birthday is next Sunday, man. Somebody's birthday. He's a real important dude, man. Oh, Tupac birthday, huh? Tupac. So what's, the, what's, 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 what's the plan for Monday? What's the plan for the for the look? The plan is uh, the plan. Anybody? Hey, what, 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 hey, Jay? What would Tupac say? The plan was the plan is give bitches. Nah, I know. Get some barbecue after the parade. I'm gonna go over there. I always do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get I know my cousin barbecue. supposed to be. My cousin gonna probably be around town. Uh, Caribbean Kitchen, Jay. It's called yeah. Caribbean. Oh yeah, kitchen. I told. I told him he asked what's going on. I said probably sensation. So, uh, I see, I, I look like yeah, we got to see the nightcap. So we'll we'll just go on and say Friday yeah. night. Well, yeah. well, Friday night is J Dog and Zero concert. Yeah. Saturday is the 
they, it's based like a trucker's dance, they say, but it's the, yeah. it's the, I forget the, I can't never say the name, the Jewel Brookside team. or Brookshire. It? It, it's where Harvey Hall was, but the, it's yeah. got a new name, it's a new building. Yeah. It's like trail ride groups and stuff. Nah, school? it's it's truckers, gonna be like a truck. Truckers, it's like truckers. a grown up affair, you know. Pretty much the Empire crowd. The yeah, it's gonna be Empire that's, since and then, Empire closed. Yeah, and then shit. A lot of people probably will go to the jungle and then sensation. They gonna have some. So yeah, I think it's. I mean, it's gonna you know you just. I think it'll be a good night sensation. I think that'd be. That's the, I, think, it. I think that's gonna be the next night. That's it. But uh, I might even yeah. watch uh, what's the name? I ain't watching. I might watch uh, Sunday night. Uh, you know what I'm talking about. All eyes on me. Oh yeah. And now I got I got YouTube TV now, so I can watch the game. Who about resurrection? So uh, Sunday night tomorrow, get the little nightcap. I watch the game. You talk about YouTube Gemini TV. Gemini should be. Uh, yeah. They should be grateful. They should oh, be yeah. grateful. Shout out to YouTube TV. Shout out to Netta too. My friend birthday on, on the same day. I, I gotta give her a shout out. So we talk about, but I'm gonna talk about Tupac. It's Tupac. Yeah, shout out to Tupac. Damn, I. Hey Jake, real talk, no bullshit. Since he on that, he don't want to turn me on to the song. I was listening to All Eyes on Me on the way that I listened to Check Out Time because it was in my head and I listened to Can't See Me, of course. Yeah. I make a motherfucking shake rally roll. Hey, speaking of the albums, I, I got to, I, I guess I do. I oh, yeah, we'll talk about the Yellow Wolf. I just got to listen to it. Oh, I just, I've been listening, but I got to listen to it the whole time I was in the car yeah. driving. At first, when I first heard it, I was like, okay, it's okay. Not better than Mud Mouth. Then I started listening. I got some good songs on there. Like some of the songs I didn't like at first, I started to listen to them. I like them more. It's a nice album. Production beats wise, Mud Mouth still better. Yeah. Beats wise, production wise, the this one's still nice, still good. I like it. I can listen to it. I can pretty much put it on and drive through it and listen to it, even with songs that, like people don't. They sleep go. People sleep on Yellow Hair, you know. We can't be like we can't be riding around like say like yeah. Pookie gonna put in a yeah he ain't gonna put in yellow it, on it's TV. Gotta be, it ain't, you know, it ain't crunk enough, you know. Yeah, you it got you gotta really like music to do. You like I, I can't it, explain. It's just a vibe. It's just a I don't want to know. You call it side of people. A lot of people don't like them. People like them, but it's the all crowd that we hang around mostly don't be into it's that. It's a type mellow. Thing. I don't know if you want to yeah. say it's a mellow vibe. It's just. Yeah. I, I mean. <laughs> You was like, man, well, shit, I need some upbeat like Rowdy. You know, I need yeah. more of that. I was like, okay, well, shit. Yeah, but get crazy, but I'm like, it's not even a race thing. But we more, just want to party. Like, uh, I would say, like, if I we went to, like, the Electric Cowboy or whatever, yeah. they would probably be more uh, Yellow Wolf fans there well, than at the yeah, Empire. Yeah, because I, I got to find some Yellow Wolf fans. I got to find some MGK fans. Yeah. yeah. Uh. Whatever shit. Because he got that rock and roll type of he, he can yeah. get all the he got all the general he can bring all those people in, not just rap, you know. That's why people don't, listen to him. But don't you dare say he can't, cause then we'll have to yeah. put that bloody Sunday on your ass. Oh, that's my friend. <laughs> uh, did, okay, did he say this is last I remember the last song you said again, something about the last song. This is this his last album or is this just another album? I wonder, like I don't know. I don't know if I heard last album, but uh but now, then I, I heard, well, he, I know I said Eminem song. He, they say it's not. He, he's, he might be straight for a while. He put all the yeah. albums out there. Well, I put this the, album, like, all a new one. if he's talking about the depth, the depth, that's Hugh Denny song. If that's going to be the way the album going to be, I'm ready to hear that song. I'm ready to hear that album. I'm, that's going to be crazy. He's going to be saying some real crazy. Yeah. He said some controversial stuff. That people say, he said, I like the line he said about Megan Thee Stallion. You're like, yeah, shot at her. Yeah, that should be a that should be an honor, man. He's like, what's, yeah, yeah. yeah, she gonna get down the street. <laughs> and then he said something about little uh, people acting like transgender, they, they acting like Siamese cats. They acting like some acting like acting black, but acting like a Siamese cat. So it was crazy. It's funny to me. I don't I don't care. People, these cats could be they been all for offended on stuff. He can say if an at this point can say black people freak freak forget all black people, y'all suck. I don't care. I hate y'all all. And I still listen to him. At this point, I didn't like him. Like, what he say? What he say? Let's get it. come out and say, look, what's up? Look at all y'all niggas. He could say that, and I'll still like him. I mean, it's just, it's Eminem. At this point, Eminem can do whatever he want. <laughs> He's like, oh, that's why ain't nobody going to battle, huh? Yeah, this is, ain't nobody going to Eminem. Calling him white boy. Ain't nobody calling Eminem white boy. <laughs> like this did Drake. Oh, you can go, you can get away with Drake. Yeah, I am a fucking bump. I do live in a trailer park with my mom. <laughs> yeah, Eminem is the, I think he's just the top rapper of all time right now. And like Camille is my top in Texas. For me. Hey, that Camille, man. I don't really care. He probably been doing some new music. Man, look. Uh, DJ, 
Paul, what a, uh, DJ Bull would be on Facebook. He said it a long a minute ago. He never replied to my message, but he That's said something about something. I might just drop. He said he's rapping again. He just drop something out of the to, sky, like. Yeah, anything for me, I'm, I'm on. I'm ready for it. If you wanted to, how many mixtapes so, you come out with uh, next month? You know? Man, I drop by four, five. I got yeah. too much bagged up shit. I'm pretty sure. I, I, would, I would say I wish we could hear the damn what's that Venom album that he was supposed to put out from the universe. I wish they. I'm pretty sure they said Universal got those songs, so he don't own them or something. Venom. But I wish Universal could just put them out or something. Just yeah. do a bootleg version. Here, this is stuff that we was gonna put out. They'd probably be a little outdated now, but still, it's the probably good. I mean, I don't know if it takes, like, and I'm not being funny. I'm like, well, do he have to pass away for y'all to put out something? Yeah. Like, I mean, you know, I, was, the, yeah, I don't know how to Once they on the rights to your stuff, they can put it out. Like, yeah. Or if you got to get your catalog. Like, Michael Jackson wanted to buy, like, Michael Jackson bought Eminem's catalog, even though he's dead now. Yeah. Eminem don't own it, stuff like that. And I, I was listening to this crazy guy. I listened to Michael Jackson. He's going to buy Marvel. Hey, Mr. We, Before he died, we missed the empire. Yeah. We missed the empire. As well, so that's a Mercedes mo, ain't it? Mr. Mr. Something Reason. like that. The lady, that's, uh, yeah, yeah. Well, she that's made the, hey, she made the best mixed drink out there. Yeah, tell Mercedes, tell Mercedes, tell Mercedes, I miss her. Where's she at? Yeah, yeah. They, they said that he was. They said Mike Jackson was about Marvel, and he said he's gonna make everything that Disney Plus did. That's what Mike Jackson wanted to do. And you see, he ended up dying. People say, yeah, he killed Mike Jackson. Yeah, Mike Jackson 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 killed Mike Jackson. Yeah, and they trying to sell. He's kind of, he got seen the all listen to the audio. He's like, yeah, we're gonna make, uh, we can make, we can take ET and Marvel. We take the characters. We can make the channel. We can do anything. He said we can do everything we want with this. And you see what happened? Disney did everything that Michael Jackson was talking about doing. Disney plus Disney did it, and then Disney doing it. That's Not Diddy. Diddy didn't do it. Disney did it. <laughs> and it's funny you said did. I sent I sent him. I'm like, man, I can't even drink the rock no more. <laughs> Jacob video. He don't. We don't talk about that. <laughs> Did it well? Look at the drink. I need to go get these snow cones from this pump. I can make it in time. Uh, that's for the nightcap. We got the shirts pinned in the description. Uh, I don't got no shirts, but y'all can cash yeah, at me. Look, y'all trying to make an order of tequila? <laughs> we're, we're we're taking the orders. We yeah, trying to that pre order catch yeah. up on the back order. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We appreciate it. Uh, <laughs> get you some for Juneteenth. Get you some for yeah. Uh, Oh, but yeah, y'all can't get that dub. Y'all ain't in the drink. Get the dub energy drink. W.gg. Use my code RBG. Hey, I'm going to bring it to you, the dub energy drink. They got different flavors, different colors, everything. Yeah, my cheap ass will <laughs> use Rob's code. To get... Yeah, they get like, it's like 20% off or something like that. Get you 20% off, and then you get some uh, other, other final boss tequila. You can get yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, go... Now, you can't get it at zip, Zips or Lipton. Yeah. You can't get it there yet. They do got <laughs> Kevin Hart tequila, though, but get, <laughs> get my tequila. Everybody tequila. Get... Now, give me some tequila. I ain't a drink. I might just make Yeah, I got you some in the what's the name outside. But <laughs> like, we'll give a shot. Hey, Chad, we, hey, Chad, somebody <laughs> asked about you, dog. I'm going to message you. Somebody asked about you. My best friend asked about you. He looked like, that's a name. I, saw, I thought I thought this dude played. There's a dude on my Facebook that played Madden. His name yeah, is Chad. Great cornhole player. Great cornhole yeah. player. That's a dude that played Madden the exact same name. I thought he was one of that guy. I'm like, hey, you know that guy too? I bet he ready for NCAA football. Yeah. Me and him used to go at it, boy. Oh, he said, oh, yeah. I'm ready. Oh, I, I'm top, top. Oh, you know what? They, they talking about a list. This is the list. I wish. I, I don't care about being on a cheap <laughs> list. Yes. I want to be on the top Madden players of East Texas. I'm, oh, I'm oh, top oh, Madden oh. players of East Texas. Me, 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 and me. That's yeah. it. The top man players of y'all folks. I'm gonna post it. And then we get the game. Yeah, yep, that's how it is. You just top right. top man and player in East Texas is me and me only. That's just that's the that's the clear cut fact. I know we got you know your boy Smitty all them. They do nope. It's just me. It's me. no big F the big three. It's just big me. That's what it is. That's a, that might be a shirt right there. If the big Shed three what's happening? is just big same me. Same birthday as my mom. The, you know, my, my dad got the same birthday as my baby mama. That's crazy. <laughs> that's that's crazy. <laughs> Sherry, so fly. Miss Williams is so fly. Well, yeah, that's I think that's the list I want to be on. And I'm ready for college football. Oh, oh speaking of Madden, there's Madden 25. Read the, the damn. They give us this, like, a preview where we can play it and test it out. Yeah. In June, so next week I had it. I'm gonna have my thoughts on what I think the game. Is. I think the game will be garbage because they always <laughs> lie to us. So I'm gonna give y'all my thoughts next week on a video about how Madden 25 is. Because I got the, I'm gonna get to play it early tomorrow, or not tomorrow, but next week 
after Juneteenth stuff. It's probably going to be like a Sunday because I'm going to be Juneteenth. Sunday, be Sunday, Sunday. But yeah. Yeah, I might not even. Yeah, you know, I will get Sunday night football early. This. Hey, see, I might not even have time to do it. Cause shit, I'm gonna be whatever we're gonna be going on. I might not forget about. It. Damn, did I put? Damn, you know what? I signed up for Xbox too. So now I gotta cut the Xbox on. Keep it on. I want to be on my PS5. PS5 is the greatest. I nah. thought PS5. PS5 is the best. All the game on PS5 is the greatest. The Last of Us. I'm gonna play that. Don't let Jake hear it. Boy. Lords of Tenshuki or whatever this game is. Ghost of Tenshu. That game is amazing. It's a ninja game, like a samurai game. Greatest game ever. I've been playing the hell out of that game. I've been playing yeah, more than Madden. The Samurai Souls. I love it. Yeah, PS5 was... They, it's definitely worth the $500 and 600 800 everybody was paying at the time. It's definitely worth it. I'm telling you that. It's definitely worth it. There it is. Definitely. I thought I was an Xbox fan for a long time. And I was like, well, you know what? Let me go back to PS. I, I used to have PS2. It was the last PS place mm-hmm. I had. And I said, let me go back and get, let me get one. I want to play Spider-Man. I finally beat, I beat that game. Story, great, great game there, too. I beat it finally. And, uh, yeah. That's crazy. That's what it is. And the last, last thing, last words. We're going to get these snow cones. Yeah, yeah. Last, last words. Tight outs. Uh, it's hot as hell. Uh, he talking yeah. about the sum, uh, summer. Hey, it's hot yeah. as hell. Um, it's it's hotter than a Thanksgiving oven out there, so go get your snow cones. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's what hey, it's hotter than um no, I don't know about they feelings. I was gonna get somebody a shout out, but look. Hotter than some hookers on the fourth corners. Oh Lord. <laughs> <laughs> man, it's hotter. Yeah. Man, it's hotter than um me and Jake when we get on two K and we are and we yeah. on the same team. Well, we are, stay. That's my two K partner. Two K I got I get you see my video. I hate two K with a passion now. I ain't like 2K since 13. Well, well, you, well, how do y'all how do y'all shoot the ball in that game? I, I actually, yeah, yeah. but actually, you want to come? I I went to God Mark. when y'all play 2K. Let me know because I was playing yesterday. <laughs> okay, I actually yeah. had a actually I actually ended up winning finally winning two games. I'm in a pretty and I, I played with the the uh, Celtics. I played like the regular team. Then I had the, then I played with the Nuggets. I had an epic comeback game with the Nuggets. I was just balling with Jokic and shit. And just I find I, I can make shots with if I can if I take the shot the shot timer thing off. I can kind of make shots, but underneath the basket, no matter what I do, it's either a block or it's, he misses it. You got to be super wide open and you get want green. You how to play with MB? Yeah, how do you, I don't know how to play I'm with MB. I don't know how to play with them. Yeah, I don't know how to play with it. I can't shoot. The only person uh, I cannot shoot fuck with. Am I? I cannot shoot with the, uh, what's his name? Donovan Mitchell. His shot's so late. That's the only person I can't shoot with. Hey, I'm going to see if I'm shoot with him then, Jay. Since he, I don't know. His shot is so delayed. But it's, I know if you play against him, he'll whip yeah. your ass up. Now, I can shoot with Jokic, and I can do stuff with Jokic. Jokic is the reason I can't. I was down like 20 points, and I came back and beat this guy 39 to 38 or something like that. Damn. Epic comeback. I, I was playing just like the damn Nuggets. Like, are they down? Okay, let's just show where we are. And I was I just killing him. Like <laughs> wow. Let's get that big man game on. Oh, yeah, the big I mean, man. Y'all be playing on teams and stuff. Like that. Yeah, spies. he be playing. <laughs> he, he, like, he's great at wing, like, wing, like, yeah. wing playing. Like, just like I was Kawhi, yeah. he was Paul George. Man. Yeah, because what y'all play on PS5? Well, it don't matter. It's the same thing. It's about PS5. Yeah, we on PlayStation. We on, uh, Okay. I got I got on PlayStation. I got on fast PlayStation. I just can't shoot. I don't know how the hell y'all make it. Y'all be, what's y'all percentage on shooting? Like, do you be 30, I mean, 20%? I'll be like 20%. Know. That's what that's buying like 20%. No. <laughs> For instance, like, if he have a bad game, it's like, well, yeah. like, we got, we we play on the, like, like we playing yeah. with James Harden because his shot. Yeah, I can shoot with James. He, if he can shoot nobody, that shot's not that easy. The but one, once yeah. he get a couple, okay, cool. Yeah. But, like, I, I remember the days in 2K, you just knew they shot. Like, I used to know Dirk Nowitzki's shot so I could shoot with him. I knew yeah. I knew KD. I could shoot with KD all day. I'm still going shoot with KD. Who was that motherfucker? Yeah. Who we try to play with, Jake? I was like, nah, we can't play yeah. with him. I can't shoot with that motherfucker. So y'all use a shot meter or y'all cut it off? Good. I could only way I can shoot is right. Nah, we, we use a shot meter. Now, yeah, that, meter. now that aim and shit, we don't do that yeah. shit. I could I cut everything well, you off. Aim the shot, fuck all that. The only way I can make a shot if I cut the shot meter off. I cut it off and that's how I went. That's how I won that game with the nuggets. I cut it off and made the comeback. I can't shoot the I can't use the meter. I cut this shit. That is terrible. Now I'll be honest. I haven't hit a three with MB. I, now everything else, I fade away. I'm like Kobe out there. I'm dunking on motherfuckers and blocking. I'm hey. Shit, I'm hey. blocking everybody on Twitter. <laughs> Dude, I'm blocking, blocking everybody. everybody. I'm blocking 
Everybody, everybody, celebrities, everybody. I don't give a fuck who it is. Hey, you got to, I to, to get on some 2K because I, I'm sure I, I got a dash. I cannot shoot with the damn in that game. Nah, he can tell you about the meter, though. That's, that's the guy to talk to, man. He, I mean, shit. It's just yeah. if you know the player, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it, my thing be like right underneath the basket. I try to do a little turnaround hook. Little we'll turn around, lay and just brick, brick, brick. But then too, you gotta like, you know, like me, like I'm facing, like, like I'm going against Bam out of yeah. Bayou or somebody like that with shit. Well, I hardly yeah. get blocked, you know what I'm yeah. saying? But you gotta, you know, you gotta just get, get blocked all the time. It, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we go, we gotta do a 2K game, 2K something, 2K spins. Let's show up. We gotta face. I didn't show you. Y'all be on 2K. Get online again with me. I'm gonna. Uh-oh, join up with y'all. Uh, I'll join up with y'all. <laughs> Let me get up for it. We gotta get to, I'm gonna try to get to this place, snow cone I'm food. Your brother, love you. And we out of here. Uh, all the fine women that I said y'all fine. I'm gonna. I know y'all didn't tag. Y'all didn't say nothing. In my last tag when I tag y'all, Smitty and Wadi and all that. Gabby. I didn't put Gabby in my fine. Yeah. She's fine, but I think look wise, Smitty got all of them. Oh yeah. Body wise, well, Smitty got there too. It was. But the best one of the best bodies. Gabby probably got she lead a one or two. I put one or two. Gabby the body, man. Y'all check <laughs> that page. Yeah. Gabby yeah. The body. We have out here. Peace. Uh okay, off YouTube right here.